Many times the, the, the 20-somethings are interested in getting into startups. And you know, it sounds glamorous, uh, probably 98% of them flame out. And so what happens is uh, they end up getting into their 30s and they still have nothing. So there is something to be said. If they get a job and they're able to work for a company that has a 401k plan, uh, and specifically if they had a 401k Roth plan, uh, to be able to get into that, start making contributions and get their employer match for it. So at least if they've got, you know, five, six, seven years uh, in there, they've got something to start with which is going to stay tax deferred. Second, uh, if you are not in that type of situation, I would forget about a traditional IRA account. I don't think that makes sense. I think what you should be doing is investing in a Roth IRA. And with a Roth, you will not be getting any current tax benefits from it. However, the money accrues tax deferred and when you pull it out, it's tax free. And I can just tell you with our national debt at $21 trillion, that's with 12 zeros and a 21 in front of it, uh, tax rates are going to be going up significantly over your lifetime. And so it makes sense today to put money away when you're getting relatively low tax rates because when you pull it out down the road, the tax rates are going to be, I think, significantly higher. Have that taken out of maybe even a payroll deduction and sent to a Roth IRA where you don't see it, um, that might be something that's great. If you find you're absolutely choking with that because of the college debt you're paying off and everything else, just take 5% of your income. Surely you can put away 5% of your income into um, a Roth IRA account. And if you do that, you just have to trust me, the benefits to you in your 20s are tremendous because in fact, most people don't uh, start thinking about retirement until they're about 40 because that's when they generally start making some money. And the amount that you have to put away at 40 is significantly greater uh, if you have done nothing up until that point relative to people who are putting away 5% of their income when you were 22, 23, 25 years old. Uh, it makes it a whole lot easier at 40. You have to put away a whole lot less. So, you know, while it may not be a killer, you can put away 5% of your income into a Roth in your 20s, just do that. And if you do not have the financial discipline to do that, just take a look at someone who's 70 or 72 years old and say, that's going to be me, but the only difference is I'm still going to be working, and they probably aren't.